Otavio, you've been here at the Jay on the Beach event. It's a very, very cool event. And how are you liking the event? Well, it's fantastic. It's too close to the beach. It's hot. Maybe you went today to, to the beach, right? Mm -hmm. Yes. So you pull a, a, a little. Oh, it's a good place to see. A huge community. A lot of people to meet here. A good network. And how about you? Do you like So I love the event, you know, we had so many good speakers that we talked to, uh, we, we met lots of good friends here, we made new friends, I mean, we had such an amazing community, you know, the Malaga Javis group uh, is here, the Madrid Javis group is here, yeah. uh, you know, there's, there's, there's all kinds of people from all different languages, and even, you know, we have the Scala guys, yeah. or we have people from Python, it was really, really cool, I, mean, I, I love it to meet all the people here in the event, and I agree with you, you know, it's a wonderful place, Malaga is amazing. Now, you know what the thing that kind of got me, right, really, really, like, kind of blow my mind? The fact that the mayor of the city, uh, he was here and, you know, he met with all these speakers. Wasn't that cool? Yes, it's really cool. I think that shows the, com the, the, com um, the commitment of the, of the city with technology and uh, with the community here. Yeah, that shows that how computer is important to everyone, right. to our society. That's very, so cool. So now, Otavio, you talking about, um, uh, you know, big data and, and cloud uh, and CDI. Can you tell us a little bit about your talk and when, what was discussed? Yeah, yeah. Of course, I did a presentation today with Bruno Souza, <laughs> my colleague here. Basically, you talk about how can I put CDI uh, Custer under a large search, everything together. Just uh, one important he thing here is I use a small piece of Java E. I, I don't need to use every part of C Java E, mm -hmm. and I can plug it together because CDI works as I glue because I can use event, I can use injection point, I can use CDI to man manage all my resources, to close all my session, all my transaction, to manage everything around the no SQL database, Elasticsearch, everything. That's a good point. Also, you run it a container, right, Bruno? Yes, that's, that's really cool. And the one interesting thing is that you merge all those technologies, and their their technology being used by very very large companies. You know, so you get you get companies like Facebook or Netflix or Salesforce and so many many others, like huge companies with huge installations. And, and they're running uh, those very, very scalable, very high performance systems on top of those same technologies, Cassandra, Elasticsearch, they're running Java. And so uh, what we are showing here in, the, in our presentation that you, know, you uh, can actually run even small projects on, the, on, on systems that actually scale for large companies because they're all open source. So it's all, you know, yeah. it's free and available. Uh, so it's really, really good that we show this. Yeah, you can also scale up so easy. Yes. Okay, so another thing, thing that, that we talked about was uh, how you can use containers to separate all of those uh, uh, applications on, on their, their separate container. We can encapsulate them, and then it's very easy for us to move from different cloud providers and actually even have that solution of multi-cloud providers. So I think it's really cool right now that uh, the technology world allows us to uh, uh, create a, an, an infrastructure that's very, very easy to create. It's very scalable, can grow really fast, and allows us to use any, any cloud provider uh, so we, we can actually go from small companies, really large ones with the same yeah. kind of solution. Yeah, because, you know, uh, locking is not a good, it's not a good stuff to, to us Java developers and software engineer. Yeah. Because you are locking uh, some vendors, some providers, not good enough. Yeah, you know, every time you lock it into someone, you know, they might raise prices or you, you might have less choices. Yes. Uh, there's a guy called Simon Phipps and he, he likes to say that, you know, standards and open source gives you the option, I mean, the freedom to choose again. Because you choose one time, but then a few years later you can choose again because you're using standards. You're not yeah. locking it into, into anyone. That's exactly, exactly because we are believe in JCP. That's we believe in... Java standard in open source, right, bro? Yeah. So you talked about JCP in the, in the talk, right? Yeah, so yeah, because, so what, can you can you t briefly tell you tell tell everyone what the JCP is? Yes, uh, JCP is an organization that take care of the Java standards. So right. now 
if you have used some GSR, some API, you don't take care about the locking stuff. Right. So basically, you know, the, the Java community process, the JCP, is a place where we all discuss the future of the Java technology. Yeah. That's absolutely. So, so, and it's so nice that anyone can join the JCP right now. And, uh, and there's a lot of cool technology that you can use. And we showed some of the, the cool technology in our talk. Um, and I think this, is, this was like a really powerful so developers can actually uh, uh, go, you know, and, and, and use those technologies knowing that they were going to be here around for a long yeah, time. Yeah, yeah. With JCP 2.10, it become mm -hmm. easier because you don't need to, to assign anything. Just use form and this site. Yeah. So really easy. I believe in two minutes you can become member of JCP. Right. Okay. So uh, one last thing, uh, you know, you, you, you talked about your talk about, uh, you know, containers and, 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 and all, all this, uh, you know, all this technology and everything. Uh, do you think cloud computing is important for developers right now? Yes, it's really important to us. That's why we're looking for, for it in the ACP. We're looking for more standard to, to Java and clouds, something like that. Okay, that's really cool. So I think that, that I, I think the message, the main message that we have here is that uh, you know, us developers, I, we have to always be looking uh, ways for you to improve our careers. And yes. you know, open source, uh, all the tools that we show in our talk, uh, open source tools that they are a great way for you to improve your career. Uh, you know, participating on, on, on standard process like the JCP is also a great way for you to increase uh, your curriculum and, and, and show value uh, to the community and especially participate on Java user group, right? So Otavio, you run a Java user group in Brazil. So how is it, what's like uh, to be part of a Java user group? Oh, it's really, really important to your career because you met, you met people there, you have more network, you can share experience, uh, you can maybe find your new colleague there because, you know, Twitter is in community. Mm -hmm. And the, the mainstream company, don't look to your resume. Just look to your GitHub, look to your participation, yeah. look to your Twitter. So that is it. That's right. So, so I think it's, you know, so you, you guys should join your local user group and, and, and participate in the community. A lot of the, the speakers that we interviewed here said that the biggest change in their life was when they start to participate, when they start to contribute either to open source or to contribute to the community. So I think it's really good that, that, that you know, you can do this. And I think that it was really important that, that uh, uh, you know, the Jay on the Beach events had a lot of community participation, a lot of people from, from, from everywhere. And so this way, it helps us uh, to actually uh, get, uh, uh, you know, helps all of us developers to be uh, more in contact and to be uh, more responsible for our own careers because we can actually join all the communities and, and, and improve what we're doing. Yeah, exactly. By the way, we, we did a, a tour around here in Europe, so... You finish here, you look to many counts, many cities here, mm -hmm. and everyone in the community say how important it is to become a member of some community. Yeah, so I would like to thank uh, the Jay on the Beach event uh, because to allow us to be, you know, we, we, it's the last stop on the Java Europe tour. And, you know, we, we went to Germany, went to Switzerland, we now are here in Spain. And thanks a lot for the Jay on the Beach event to receive us so well. And everyone here, you know, all the participants, all the speakers, the organization, it was really good. You know, we loved this, this event. It was excellent. So I hope to be here uh, next year, right? Because I know there's already all kinds of talks about the next event, right? So that's, that's how, how great events are. Once a great event ends, we're already looking forward to the next one. So thanks a lot, Jay on the Beach, and we're going to be here for the next one. Thank you. See you next year. Thanks.